So we know the multiple myeloma is a very difficult disease, the hematological malignant disease. Uh, in China also, the, because it's more and more the elder patients, the growth and the population. So I think the multiple myeloma, the patients, uh, the, the finally the developed to the refractory and the ref relate, uh, refractory and the relapse patients. And uh, uh, also the, the now we have the, the new medicines, just like uh, the target therapies, but it's also difficult to treat the, such patients. So the immunocellular therapy, I think, is a new is a wonderful option for such patients. The CAR T uh, therapy for multiple myeloma, now we focus on the BCMA antigen. So because the multiple myeloma patients, the, the plasma cell, the expansion the BCMA antigen. So for the clinical study, I think that China has developed the many sentence clinical studies. Until now, two uh, articles have published in the Journal of Hematological Oncology and the PNAS, and indicated that they have the, such the, uh, summaries of the, the BCMA CAR T cells for the, such the treatment. And the uh, average about the uh, corresponding response, response later about the, about the 90 to 100%. And the CR and the very good PR about the 80 percent. I think it's a very good results. And for our sentence or for our the institute, we also perform the BCMA CAR T therapy for patients. And we recruit about the 33 cases in the or the clinical study, and we find such the patients, and the overall response is very good, about the 100 percent. And a very good uh, PR and uh, the CR about the 80 percent. Until now, we follow such the patients, uh, such the patients would like to the long term the, the, the follow such the patients. So I think the CAR T therapies in, uh, indicated a very effective therapy for the refractory and relapsed patients. Until now, it's very good results.